A second way of approaching the movement and especially the dance movement is of course modeling through clay. So usually he has a big piece of clay and he will quickly model do a sketch but with the clay. Terracotta version of the dance movement are very moving and very interesting piece of his art that interestingly remains secrets during his lifetime is the only element that are really touched by Rodin, that are really modeled by Rodin. Rodin usually model as a first part of his creative process. He usually give the plaster cast and the other operations to what we call practitioners or operators, people working for him in his studios. Terracotta are quite a valuable part of his creation. He is a well-known modeler. It's the first medium on which he works. Uh, when he has an idea, he either draw it or he take a piece of clay and model it. And that's why it's so precious and interesting to show these elements to the public.